Right, let's uh, go get these guys and girls. Rescue Evelyn. Evelyn, just don't touch her. If she's recording, you'll scramble her brain. Wait until I cut her link. Oh, what? Oh my god. This is pretty messed up. I see her. Cable 2. Grab it and tell me when you're gonna yank it. I'll break the link at my end at the same time. Let's do this. Oh, Evelyn. Wait for my signal. Here goes. Ready? And? Now! Thank God. Ev? Evelyn, you hear me? Is she okay to be moved? No brain hemorrhages, damage to the spine. It doesn't seem to have any wounds. Guess we got no choice. What's that? And that? And that? Let's get her somewhere safe. Fast, too. Which way? I sealed the doors and managed to power the elevators. Elevators it is, then. Hey, Judy, anyone gets in our way, you shoot them. It's like shit and make my head spin. But once I start something, I don't quit. From one addict to another, I sympathize. We going in? Let's give him a couple. You saw how she looked. If it was up to me, I would have splashed some water on her face back at the studio and asked her straight up. Damn. It's not up to you, though, is it? Let's go. Dude, give her a minute. Sure, not right now, man. Not right now. Hey, this is a nice place. Oh, it's got to be Judy's, hasn't it? Massive octopus on the wall. She's sleeping. Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. I'm interested, honestly. I just want to quickly do this. You're mad at her? Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. 
Judy, I didn't have any I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. Guessing you saw them already. Yeah. Had to wrestle to make sense of the whole thing. But I don't want to say anything and taint your perspective. You should go in with fresh eyes. How many BDs did you manage to rip? Two. Only one of them's intact. Understandable, though. The rest... Well, they're in the same shape as Evelyn right now. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit, this does not look good. Hey, how you feeling? You need anything? I'm not here to nag. Just talk. After what she's been through, I'm not doing that. Have a seat. All right, roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape, not all that editable. Glad you managed to salvage them in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy, but I did what I could. God, I don't know what I'm gonna see here. I can't remember. What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it and be parfait, Bori. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxed self. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself, uh, should I... Biochip? Will you hear this? That is not of interest to you. You spin the virtue, you come back here. We give you the eddies. That is your one job. The rest is none of your concern. Understand. Oh my gosh, it wasn't even... What am I looking out for? Take a look around if you want. Every single piece of tech I... Can't see your face. <sighs> Under normal circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. That, or someone's working it for her. See, security? We knew. Peter, he's a nice What am I? Hmm. I think I recognize these. What are they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys, but that's just a hunch. Can't be 100% sure. The spine chilling Netrunner crew? Hard to find, because they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to start. Looking out for And if he starts talk talking about the bio chip? Might not be important. Maybe. All of them are from Pacifica. Now's down our search, at least. What now? Looks like I'm going on a field trip to Pacifica. All right, think we got everything. Damn. Gonna walk into the den of wolves. What do you think? Wolf voodoo boys. The woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. 
Now we know what happened to Clouds. They're the ones who tried to flatline her. Launched a nuke at her ship. So it was punishment? For getting played by her? She knew more than they thought she knew. Couldn't let that go. So that's who she was running from. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me. If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into... Ugh, I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. It's pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. And brought this all on herself. On you two. There's one more recording. Oh no. Wanna see it? Sure. Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. Oui, allez. Nous t'as qu'une raison, mon zé, tout intelligent pour ça, pour t'es bien. Mon zé, pas enragé. En plus, c'est plus bon moyen de nous gagner pour nous arriver sur yon nom. Faut que nous pour t'en cela. Faut gagner plus bon l'idée? Très bien. Si vous décidez si c'est bon critique, ça me pense. I continue to do work. What language is she speaking? French? I don't know. Haitian Creole? Yeah, it could be Haitian. It is the Voodoo Boys. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto-translator. Meantime, you try to tune in to the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Try scanning the phone. Got it. Give it a second. We have to know what they're saying. It could be important. Fine. Just found the auto translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. Oui. Oui, allez. Okay, Judy, we're good. All right, disconnecting. So they, whoever it was, knew the cell phone was on the chip. I pal? don't get it. What's this have to do with Johnny Silverhand? He died, like, forever ago. Mm, hey, you got any idea? Oh, yeah. I trust her. The biochip we stole. It's, uh... It's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche. Personality construct. Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff. In my head. Uh, um, of course. By head, I mean with him. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that Juju Wirehead, okay? Wait, you got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. 
Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Thanks, Judy. No, V. Thank you. You're a... You're a good person. Evelyn could never see what was under people's skin. If she could have gotten to know you a bit better, then... Who knows? Things might have turned out differently. Oh, I think I'd say bye to her. Never mind. Unless I can. No? Need to make contact with the Voodoo Boys chief, if you can swing it. Ah, straight to biz. Ultra heavy variety. The Voodoo Boys, led by one Maman Brigitte. It's no easy feat getting an audience with her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I didn't expect you could swing this anyway. V, reverse psychology, on me. Surely you're better than that. Really not doing biz with the voodoos? Surprised? I strive to avoid risking my dealings. They pose much of it. Still, feelers I can extend. No harm in asking around. I just need information from you. A springboard, if you will. Let's say there's something I got that they want. You've got something for the VDBs. Trust me. They don't want it. They don't need it. An insular bunch all round. Tech, networks, what you will. All in-house. But, if you insist, I'll poke around. In the event of a twitch, you'll hear from me. There's a busy tour, Mr. Hannon. Let's close back. Unlocks in uh, the new uh, expansion. Right, weapons. Double check, see if we got anything good. Really, I think I will sell some of these. So that up. Uh, yeah, I don't think I want that. I know it's plus four percent quick upload time, but geez.
I really don't feel like it's working quite as well as it did. But... doing now I think I paid Victor off should we try one of these cyber psychos Before we go into here, let's quickly save it, because I don't want to get absolutely opened by this guy. Or girl, and I'll put this. Oh, 
before it's too late. Solutions, including your health insurance, I think your health insurance policy PTSD shield has been cancelled effective immediately. Any appointments made prior to this notice have been cancelled, and any medications have been discarded. Wow, now we, enforce it. we also inform you that you are welcome to use the government's veteran care program. Current appointment wait time is 756 days. Wow, it's not far off in now, I think. Uh, to register for an appointment, please send the following text message. Help. Wishing you good health and the best of luck. Yeah, right. Psychos out cold but alive, transferring you the data I gathered. Looks like it was an ex merc worker for some corpse. Susie stopped being useful, they tossed him out into the street. Guy kept his combat implants, had PTSD, stopped taking his meds. You can fill in the blanks. Thanks for going the extra mile. So a badge friend of mine just sent over his data. Guy's head was a mess. Must have taken four times doses just to make it through the day. Eventually the corp cut off his health insurance and cash dried up. And then the ticking time bomb exploded, but was it really from the implants alone? Who the hell knows? Either way, your eddies are in the air. Thanks for taking care of this. Nice. Then I'll go to the Delamain HQ. 
I'll talk to Barry while we're there as well. Why not? Finally scrounged up enough eddies to pay you back in full. Hold on to them just in case. You need them more than me. Wait, what? I'm not taking them all the way to my grave, Vic. Here. And thanks again for doing so much work on me without ever seeing an eddy. That's what friends are for. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look. Getting like the double jump ones. Hells yes. Want to install that.
like that one, yeah. Percent carrying capacity be kind of nice. I'll put that on just because I've got it anyway. Uh, yeah, I think that'll do. Spent all my money on upgrades. Uh, I'm sell anything I'm wearing, have I? No. Uh, I'm wearing them. Oh no, sorry. Uh, that one, and that one, and that one, and that one. Uh, UK 
Okay there. V, it's your lucky day. If you're serious about making headway in Pacifica, that is. Work some magic for me? As I said, whatever you're offering, the V-Boys could not, I quote, give a shit. You kept your receipt, I trust. Yet a counteroffer was forthcoming, a gig. Successful completion thereof could earn you an audience with Brigitte. Okay, so who do I contact next? Church, Sloan Lane, inside by the altar. They'll know to look for you. Desire. Got it. Thanks, Hans. New episodes every Wednesday at 10. Only on WNS. What the hell are they watching on these guys? Fair, it's probably not much difference to what we have now. Let's see what you need done. Oh no, yes. It's a blue one. Can I buy that for three hundred and four? Oh, no, it's eighteen thousand. Is that eighteen thousand? It's buying for. I definitely want to buy that. A new gun owner, I hope. Yeah. The inventory's crap. Tier weapon. Um, do we buy this assault rifle and put it on there? That is the question. Remembering that right? Who is it? Oh. V, your neighbor from upstairs. Remember me? Talked about Prem rides. Back then you were pumped about the Mizutani Shion. I said it was for flash posers. <laughs> you don't forget a gunk thing like that. I think we've all been in her shoes. You gave me this look. I was about to hightail it to the Badlands right then and there. Enjoying I remember. What do you want? Want to see what was shaking? Friends say you never leave your unit. Think I've got an inkling as to why. I've seen that look before. It's all too common among people like us. Us? <laughs> you don't look like a cop. Badges don't get a monopoly on loss. You see death every day in my line of work. And you get used to it, of course, until it hits someone you're close to. <laughs> you too. Come in. Yeah, it's not quite as good as a partner as I've got, but... I lost someone close to me, too. A damn good friend. Jackson. What do you mean, too? Wait. It's about Andrew. The, uh... I told you about him. Best bud I ever had. Known in my whole life. Only person I could spill to without being judged. You didn't have anyone to unload on at work? I bet Petrova and Mendez. 
And Petrova's a decent gal, but she's not good with this stuff. Mendez just doesn't get it. He thinks us blues need to be tough. Can't bear the sight of a kid getting murdered. Born with pussy genes. According to him. But you told him about Andrew. Honestly, I thought about it a lot. Anyway, they don't know everything. Better that way. Mendez doesn't know shit about life. Everyone's got their limits, even him. He just hasn't reached them. Not like you. What if he's right, though? Maybe my genes are soft. Don't only the strongest survive? If he felt nothing, that means his loss wouldn't have had any meaning. I guess so. Thanks for the talk, V. I am. Um, I need time to take all this in. Sure thing. No problems. Take care. Here I'm ready. You. You talked to Barry? He finally decided to get his shit together? You cry out loud, Mendez. We had a little chat. He seems chilled, but seriously down in the dumps. He's got a bone to pick with Mendez. What? So why doesn't he say so to my face? Clearly he couldn't stand his job and didn't have anyone to talk to about it. He said you didn't even try to understand him. See? Was I right? Give me a break. Barry likes playing the drama queen. You just gotta shake some sense into him, trust me. We'll see. We'll have to check in on him later. Thanks for your help. This is for your trouble. Yeah, no problems. Got another dry, sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. Help me out, I won't forget, and I never leave a favour in return. Don't bother responding, but attack blocks all comms from all unauthorised numbers, and remember, we never met. Oh, is that that uh, cyber psycho guy? Oh, that's kind of cool. that in there because I don't really use these do I Maybe that one. I just thought, am I losing anything off these? No, I never am. Um, nope. That I am, though. Yeah, 
hit that button. Jeez. I'll go for this look for a bit. It's a little different. We've got one, two, three, three of the special weapons. Cells have established. Thank you for joining all of us here at N54 News. We'll see. Right, let's save it here. Yeah. 